know, we had a bit of a longer timeline just because of circumstances. So initially, Gabby wanted to deal with some personal circumstances before he talked to, to any clubs at all because he was obviously on the marketplace. So uh, we bided our time. We had that initial Zoom call, the very first time that we had that you know, official introduction. He really did look like a witness protection. You know, sometimes you get the guy who hasn't got the light in, so we had a chuckle. It was, uh, it was almost like he came from the dark into the light as we got him to move in the room. But we had that initial discussion and, and things went really well. You know, we started the process, um, had to go, yeah, get all kinds of clearance to travel to Argentina and, and do it safely and, and follow their protocols. So Carlos and I are here at the airport. We finally got our permission to travel to Argentina. There it is, we were a day late, so we had to fly the next day, but we're heading off to uh, go and have a chat with future head coach prospects. Um, and Carlos and I managed to, you know, get out to Argentina eventually. It was, you know, it was pretty crazy. Like I said, we arrived at, at the airport of Buenos Aires, which is normally one of the busiest airports you'll ever be in. And it was like a ghost town. Um, we then went to, we ended up meeting in the hotel that was where we first met Miguel Almiron and signed him. So. Again, we felt that was a lucky memento to, to go back to a hotel that treated us well. Um, and we had two days of really good discussions. You could see out the window, we were right near River Plate Stadium uh, where we were meeting. Um, you know, and they were frank discussions. They were, they were positive, constructive discussions about you know, what our vision is for Atlanta United and explaining that in terms of uh, you know, the club, the profile that we have in, in the North America region, our amazing fan base. You know, then, then the process starts to pick up. Uh, and, and you get into some, some in-depth conversations uh, going through the, the team uh, plans going forward. Uh, you know, how are we now? What do we see the future? And, and it was nice because the conversations we're having, uh, we were aligned. I think that's the, the great news for our club and for our fans is that you know, we've got an exciting young manager and he's someone that, you know, has really could have had a pick of clubs and has chosen Atlanta United. And likewise, you know, we're excited because we feel that Gabby's going to be a great fit for what we need at this club going into a really important season in 2021.